breakpads and discs, on this uh, Volkswagen BW Getty Mark One. So you can see there's about nothing left on that pad. This disc is also uh, worn. Uh, the CV boots also worn. Well, not worn, it's torn. And uh, we're going to rep be replacing that CV boot as well. First we're going to remove the caliper Place that caliper to the side for now. Remove this part of the caliper, and then uh, we'll take off the disc. You can see the brake pad you know, that's finished. So this disc is supposed to be held in with a screw here, and that screw is uh, broken off. It's quite uh, common for these screws to break off, especially in the on the Mark 1s, if you make them too tight.
So here you can see that the uh, bolt that keeps the desk in place is broken off. It's not a big issue, but it's not right. Let's see if we can maybe draw this one out. Try to remove this by putting a T15 in there. And there you go. So I just throw the small hole and then I uh, use this T15 to punch it in there, turn it out, and there you go, fixed. <coughs> Okay, so it's also going from the normal desk to the vented desks, which is uh, way better, you can see next to each other there. So before we install the new desk, I'll just use a bit of a clean or some brake cleaner and a wire brush. Just to get some of that rust and stuff off there. Okay, so we'll just clean the backing plate a bit. CV is also makes uh, a lot of grease onto the backing plate and also like break dust and stuff I'll just wire brush this off a bit.
First thing I should have done, uh, which I didn't do, is to push this piston back. Uh, looks like that dust cover is also torn. So first thing you should actually do is push this piston back. Not to worry, if you have a big enough set of pliers, you can easily just squeeze this back. I said easily squeeze this back. <sighs> Not so easily squeeze this back. See, that's already looking a lot better than it was just a second ago. Okay, so you have a inner and an outer pad. See this one and this one. See this one is the inner pad, uh, which goes against the piston. This one is outer, which goes on the outside. So just get that right. Some people don't put this right on. So just see that there is a difference and then uh, inside, outside. Obviously, you get your new uh, rattle clips. Okay, and then the caliper. It goes on a bit tight. 